welcome to this week's update. I'm Krista um, from Amy Ann's house and this week we have been doing a lot of Christmas celebration. It's been a really good time and we haven't been doing a whole lot in the house. Um, I did sneak here one day to do a bit of Christmas um, sewing and I got to sit by the fire and it was snowing outside and I had a beautiful warm tea and it was so nice just to spend some time alone here sitting by the fire. So that was a nice day. We've also been doing some of our home setting type um, decorations like drawing oranges and apples and we've been stringing them and um, just decorating our house with our Christmas tree. The kids have also been amazingly helpful. They've been helping with chores, they've been helping around at the other house, keeping things clean and tidy. They helped me move mattresses that we used for summer camping out of the house so that we can start doing the demoing and taking off all the trim. We have decided that we are going to completely tear down all the walls and plaster and lath, so I have a lot of work ahead of me. one day and start taking off the trim. My uncle showed me how to do it, so it is a very careful and tedious process. So I will be doing this, it feels like, for the rest of my life, but I won't be. <laughs> it's just one of those times. And I'm hoping that one day he might have some free time and we can tag team it where he can take it off and I can pull all the nails and um, label it all and then go and store it so that we know where it goes or like, um, uh, we're going to put it back together because that seems to be a key. <laughs> okay, I am going to try and get this trim off of Michael's window frame. I have it loosened all along the bottom and most of the top is just the middle. So we'll see if we get it off without it breaking, falling. Those are the two big things, I think. And we'll see if that goes. Here, 
And this one has a big hole in it. It's really been beaten up in that spot. So we'll see if how that works. When my uncle did it, he just taped it. I don't know how we're gonna fix this so it looks all right. Jeff doesn't want to paint any of the trim, so I'm not sure how we're gonna fix this without painting it. But tape that so it stays. So all of these nails are the old square nails. And so that they don't put big holes in it. Like most of the time you hammer nails back through the wood. Um, so then, then you pull them out the other way. With the square nails, my uncle's experience is that you actually pull them through the back because if you try to push them back out the good, so if this is the nice piece of the wood, if you try to push them out this way, you'll get a big hole, but if you pull them this way, if you end up getting a hole, it's on the back side and it doesn't matter. So that's what we have to do now. we celebrated winter solstice which is the first time we've ever kind of done it as a big celebration we did um, a walk through the woods where we blessed the trees with some spiced up apple cider and we um, collected different items from the woods so that we could make a yule log so we did that after and we had a big bonfire and it was a really fun and kind of another magical way of celebrating the change of the seasons. So that was really, really fun. I have a whole other video on that. It's not very long, um, but just like a video of what we did. So feel free to check that out if you want. And if you like and enjoy our videos, please press the like button and subscribe to our channel so that more people can find us. Thanks. Bye.